Welcome to an exciting module of grouping and aggregation that will serve as foundation to numerical data analysis in upcoming lessons. Let's start. Import the pandas library and carstocks dataset using read csv function. Call this data frame carstocks. Use the head function to inspect first three rows of the data frame. This data set give us stock details for the car manufacturers. Let's look at the mean value of closing stock using column, close, followed by mean function. Great! The average value of closing stock is around $80. Now let's find out the average value of closing stock for each of the car manufacturer denoted by symbol. Here we have three manufacturers that can be seen by applying unique method to symbol column. However, this scheme will be lengthy and time-consuming for let's say 50 or more symbols. Then what to do? The answer is grouping method. Let's apply it to see the results. Perfect! Now let's expand on this knowledge. Import world happiness report, and explore it using head function. Let's group per region to find out the mean value of GDP per capita. Great! Now you see average GDP value for each region. You can also sort these values using sorting function. How about finding minimum or maximum values in addition to mean? The answer is aggregation function. Let's do it. You have to use curly brackets additionally. Perfect. Similarly add min keyword to find the minimum value. We can also apply aggregation function to multiple columns. Let's find average and maximum values for social support and life expectancy. and we are done. See you in the next lecture.